An incident packed County Louth Derby with the first of five goals coming on 38 minutes as Eric Foley put draw it ahead with a beautiful free kick. The highly charged nature of the game saw a half-time dust-up en route to the dressing rooms, which resulted in substitutes Philly Hughes and Simon Kelly being sent off by referee Derek Tomney. And three minutes into the second half, Draw had extended their advantage, a well-worked goal it was to Gavin Brennan stealing in at the back post. 2-0 to Draw. Two minutes later, it was 3-0 to the home side. Darrell Doyle saw his shot blocked and the loose ball fell to Declan Fabio O'Brien and he swept the loose ball to the net to give Robbie Horgan's side an unassailable advantage at that stage. The dock, though, pulled one back just after the hour mark. Darren Meenan's cross was met by the head of Joseph Hoban and he made it 3-1. Perhaps a little hope now for Stephen Kenny's side and their travelling support. Hoban certainly thought so. Minutes later, though, Drogheda had restored their three-goal advantage as Brennan's free kick was brilliantly met by a diving header from O'Brien. His second goal of the night, 4-1 now to Drogheda. And that's the way it stayed, but Drogheda's victory spoiled somewhat in the 87th minute for a dismissal on Gavin Brennan for a late tackle on Stephen O'Donnell as he was shown a straight red by referee Tomney. So we'll, we'll have to regroup, take it on the chin. It's a disappointment for everyone. Uh, I think we know that, but we've got to take the defeat on the chin and come back and make sure we're ready now for the next game. Well, it's a great start, but that's all it is. It's just a good start. And, um, you know, we've a game on Monday against Crumlin in the League Cup and we play Bowes next Friday and we'll be getting ready for them two games. With Expo's boss Aaron O'Callaghan suspended, Colley O'Neill took charge at Belfield, but the students were taught something.